The EU Commission and the European Union Intellectual Property Office, the EU IPO, set up a new European Union SME fund on Monday to help small and medium-sized enterprises, those are called SMEs, protect their intellectual property rights. Companies based in the EU can receive vouchers from the, um, what is it, 47 million euro fund. The EU IPO manages the fund through calls for proposals. The first call will be published um, this week on the EU IPO West website. Grants can be requested during the entire period of 2022 to 2024. A special meeting on the fund is planned for February 11th as part of the European Industry Days, which interested SMEs can also take part online. An executive vice president, Margrethe Festeyer, said about this, they rightly say small but mighty, because if SMEs want to grow and play a pioneering role in terms of new technologies, they have to protect their, inven no, their inventions and creations, just like large companies do. New ideas and expertise are the most important added value we have in the EU. With this fund, we would like to support SMEs to face the challenges of this strange time and to remain strong and innovative in the coming decades. The EU's 47 million euro SME fund provides the following support. It's reimbursement of 90% of the fees charged by member states for services related to the pre-diagnosis of intellectual property rights, the so-called IP scanning services, which provide a comprehensive assessment of the IP needs of the applicant SME, taking into account the innovation potential of its intangible enable assets. Then the reimbursement of 75% of the fees charged by intellectual property offices, including national intellectual property offices, the European Union intellectual property office, and the Benelux Intellectual Property Office for the registration of trademarks and designs, and the reimbursement of 50% of the fees charged by the World Intellectual Property Organization for obtaining international trademark and, of course, design protection, and a reimbursement of 50% of the fees charged by national patent offices for registering patents in 2022 and a possible coverage of further services from 2023. For example, partial reimbursement of the cost of the novelty search for patents and for the registration of patents or the private consulting services in the field of intellectual property by intellectual property lawyers, for example, for patent registration, license agreements, evaluations of intellectual property rights, costs of alternative dispute resolutions and so on. And I'll see you in my next video. Bis gleich.